When someone sees one of my paintings, I want them to really feel the place that I'm depicting. And so my uh, desire is that they're going to want to travel into that painting and become part of it. I started my career at Disney Studios in the mailroom and uh, 19 years old. I sold my first painting to Roy Disney Senior for $30 and then became a background painter and headed that department up for 22 years. And I did uh, Fox and the Hound, Little Mermaid, Beauty and the Beast, both Rescuers movies, um, Great Mouse Detective, Mickey's Christmas Carol, Winnie the Pooh, and several others. I think one of the reasons that I was chosen by Disney to head up these, the animation background department was color sense. And I just go again by instinct. I've, I've never really had classes. I just go with what feels good with me. I started working with the metal leafing about 20 years ago, and it's something I've been experimenting with in different ways, but it really gives a new dimension, I think, to a regular landscape that I would do, and it causes the viewer to see something different. Painting for me is an intuitive process, and so I let the canvas tell me where to go. And the paint and the canvas in me create a piece of art that people will enjoy. One of the things that I th think is interesting is people sometimes think when they look at one of my paintings that it has a Disney flair to it. So I'm not sure how much uh, the, fl the flair that Disney's films had from my own work or how much I got from them, but uh, that's something that people seem to see. There's so much ugly in this world today that I want to be a part of doing something that brings a little light into people's lives, and I think my paintings do that.